Hello everyone, this is Shadow Mario 41. Welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Conquest. In the last video, we conquered the rest of Krem... I guess it's pronounced Krem Key, which I apparently didn't know. So we conquered the rest of Krem Key, which I don't know how it's pronounced that, but the English language is very weird, so... I'm not really going to question it. Anyway, this is Hornet Hole, the first beehive level. Beehive levels contain this uh, sticky wall substance here, which I guess is honey. Makes sense. Although it's a little too orange to be honey in my opinion. But it is honey nonetheless. I guess the Super Nintendo was limited in its palettes. And yeah, we can stick to it. And uh, that'll become very useful climbing. But uh, it's noted that animal buddies cannot stick to the honey. Only the Kongs can. So... That, that comes into play a few times. Anyway, this Find the Token is actually really cool. I like this one. You just bust open the crate a bunch of times. Or the chest, and there you go. You get a token. Very nice. And there's a bunch of stuff up there we can recollect, actually. I'm going to not grab anything, apparently. And But we're going to fall into this uh, second bonus level, which is <laughs> conveniently right there. This one's really easy. Just jump up the walls. Look at that. Two seconds. Done. Quite literally. That was two seconds. They should have made the timer of that like 5, not 10. Switch to Dixie. And let's actually do the level now. Because we just got two bonus levels really quickly. Let's get rid of that zinger. And yeah, when the honey's on the floor like this, you cannot walk. You can only jump. So that comes into play a lot. Especially when there's like zingers on the honey like there was right there. And there's a banana coin up there. <clears throat> like this, we won't be able to walk, so we gotta make pretty well timed jumps. We gotta watch out for that. Spiny, those guys are actually called Spinies, not like the guy from, not like the uh, enemies from Mario Brothers, but still, same name. And another secret up here. You can find a chest, and this chest has a green balloon worth two free lives. You don't usually see very many of those. Watch out for that guy. That guy comes in to be a jerk, huh, right at the end. Climb up here, use the barrels to our advantage, and if we team up up here we can find another pretty big secret of the level that'll help us greatly. We get squitters. Squitters can walk on the honey, which is really nice. He cannot cling to walls though, but we have these arrow barrels luckily. Saves us from making a bunch of web platforms. And now we can just take out everything instead of actually, you know, trying to uh, maneuver around it, which is really nice. And of course, there's a bunch of hidden stuff that you can get with squitters, including a uh, bonus barrel, which will come up later, and a hero coin. But that's later. Right now, we can go up here and here, grab, let's see, what we got? bananas and banana coin. Nice. Make sure you don't lose squitters, by the way, in this level, because squitters will run away really fast, and it's really hard to reclaim squitters in this level, especially since it's so, you know, filled with enemies and there's a lot, a lot going on. There we go. There we go. Where that guy? Okay, down here we have to have squitters to kill that zinger and to kill these zingers. Go and up here we find a bunch of bananas and the hero coin right there. Nice. We can kill that singer to get the N, which is great. And now we follow the banana trail. I, I'm telling you, the banana trails are used so much in the Donkey Kong games, but they help so much. Otherwise, you'd just be shooting blind web platforms, hoping to find something, or exploring random areas, just hoping to stumble into some sort of secret. Anyway, this find the token is once again very easy. You just make three web platforms and jump. I don't know how many of those they really need to make. I mean, how many web platform bonus stages do you need in a game? We already had like two of them in Hothead Hop, I think it was, right? Yeah, it was Hothead Hop. We had like two web platform bonus stages. I mean, we don't need any more. I mean, they're they're really easy, and if if the game insists on being easy, then I'm not gonna be one to argue, but whatever. 
Alright, so we lose Squitters here to get a free life. And we can jump, 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 and there's the G. Nice. But we didn't get the O. How sad. It was another thing you could get with Squitters, I think. Oh well. Um, let's save. Because we haven't saved in a little while. Save game. Free. Alright, sounds good to me. If it's free, it's for me. That's what my grandpa used to always tell me. He said, remember one thing. If it's free, it's for me. <laughs> Such valuable advice. Anyway, now we have the first roller coaster level of the game. I love the roller coaster levels. They're all really fun, in my opinion. Even the ones that a lot of people deem to be frustrating are fun. So this one is Target Terror. Might be the hardest of them, actually. Uh, we pretty much have to ride the roller coaster car. I like the look of the roller coaster car, too. It fits with the theme of the, the game perfectly. And we have to hit those uh, check mark barrels to open the to open the hatches. The hatches are open. And if we don't, we lose a Kong. You can't jump over the closed gates, unfortunately. The game doesn't let you, because that would be a little cheap. And here we have guys trying to be jerks and throw stuff at us. No big deal. The music here is pretty cool, too. Disco Train, I think it's called. And we have to jump quick to get a bonus barrel there. That's one of those that, you know, if you miss, it's like, ah, oh, crap. I gotta go over back and get it. This is a destroy them all. It's very simple. You just fly around and destroy all the bees. And that's it. It's kind of weird to have a Bramble bonus level in uh, this particular level, but uh, I guess it's understandable since the next level after this is also a Bramble level. And look at that! That was the 41st Creme Coin that we collected. How about that? Missed the O. Just blatantly missed it. But that's where it is. Alright, Midway. Here we go. Now it's going to get significantly harder. We gotta jump from car to car, we gotta avoid X barrels, hit the check marks, there we go. Got the N. And get all, get all the bananas, and hero coin, don't miss that. That's, that is an easy one to miss, it's hard to see. Anyway, if you follow this guy down here where you find a bonus level, you can actually tell there's a bonus level down there because you notice he lands on a track and keeps going. That's supposed to be the hit. Anyway, this find the token is really awesome. It's really fast, and you gotta be really careful not to fall. But other than that, it's not too bad. I hope I don't die after I say that, like I did in Slime Climb. Alright, there we go. And I love how it gives us just enough time to uh, actually finish the, the level there. That's really awesome. Grab the G, and keep going. Get rid of the Zinger. Or, jump over the Zinger, I mean. Not get rid of it. That's a tough jump, and I missed. <laughs> oh, I missed! A little careful right there. If you go for that, there's a free life up there, but not worth it in my opinion. Let's just finish the level. Okay. Back here we have a hidden DK barrel, which we need to team up and get this, because we can get a free life. Nice. I like how, if you notice at the end of all the uh, level end musics, um, it, it remixes it a little bit to fit the uh, the theme of the level. So like that one had like a, you know, an amusement park theme, and then the ones in the, like the sailing levels have the pirate theme at the end. It's pretty cool. The same set of notes, but just a little different style of uh, music. So anyway, we are moving on to what is arguably the most difficult level in the game, although I don't think so. But a lot of people consider it to be at least up there amongst the elites. Bramble Scramble, and it's a really long level, so looking at the time I have left, I'll probably only get to the midway barrel, but that's good enough for me. If I don't die. Anyway, we can jump over here right away to get the K. Make sure you get that. Watch out for these guys. Kill that zinger. So yeah, this level is really hard. Just FYI. If I die, like, don't hold it against me, this level is really hard. Team up to get the invincibility. I think I think that's the only bonus barrel in the level. I'm trying to think. Yeah, I think it is. Anyway, let's just get it. 
Alright, this is the collect the stars I was thinking of before, where we have to use squawks and uh, shoot all the zingers and grab stars. It's very similar. Oh, I'm dead. It's very similar to the uh, to the destroy them all that we did in the last level, target terror. But you just fly around and shoot things. Let's go back into it right now. Yeah, after this bonus level, I'll probably cut. I don't fail it. Die! Die! No! Ugh. Well, this is Shadow Mario 41. See you guys next time when I try that bonus level again. Or maybe not, because I can't. Let's just die. Ciao.